Hello and welcome everybody, I review 99 here and welcome back to our, our, our Let's Play. You can see those pipes are going to literally explode. Um, today, from leading up from last episode we made a chunk loader and this episode I want to get this side sorted out. So, first of all, clear this out. Got a filler to do that, that'll be sick. So what we can do is you just get so fill. We'll start off by getting our buildcraft tanks. If you remember, it's crafted with just eight glass. Uh, we'll get our liquid transposer here. As you can see, as these ender chests are much cooler than vanilla ender chests, you see a color code, and you can change that color code. Here are my lava cans. See if one will fill. Hmm? 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 Oh, turn the magmatic engine off so it probably won't. <laughs> fail. So, what do we want to set this as? Go on. So, we want sort of behind to be out. Oh, we want to set this mode. So, below block, top block, back is output. Cool beans. So if we just set from the design, we want power given to this, so we'll put our magmatic engine down there. And that will pump the lava out into that and into that. Cool. So we need to get a filter here. That to filter out lava cans. And we'll have a timer. Also we need a way back for the empty cans to go. That's where these wires come in handy. I mean pipes. Want bottom to be Yep, yeah, bottom can be red. So what do we want? Want gold, sandstone, gold. So gold, sandstone, gold. The reason we put sandstone here, because if we put gold here, it'll connect. But if we put sandstone, it doesn't connect to any inventory. So, yeah, and they look cool. But mainly the other reason. So, I just need to go get another timer. So I'll go craft quickly. Uh. So pick that down. New stone torches. Where's my stake? Cool. Should have the stuff we need in here. So, what do we need? Timer. So, we need wires, which are them. We need anodes, which is that. We need a pointer, which is uh, that. 
cathode, which is that, and that. It's cathode, pointer, anode, wire, and wafers. Make our timer. Go. Store. Aluminium, wood power, keep that cobble on me. Got redstone. Where did you come from? Oh, you got a shot of minion. Cool. They ain't coming through that now. I don't know what noise that was. That was quite creepy. Um. Yeah, so what we wanted was timer, some redstone, and that stop pulling. Need a little bit of power to this, don't we? That should last a little while for us to uh, get started. There we go, as you can see it's already filled up and it went into the tank as well. So I think everyone, we're done. Let's see, you can get sent back. If we go over there, quickly, slowly but surely, you can see, but now we need another chunk loader, need another chunk loader, I can do that quickly, I've got some spare obsidian, I need some more obsidian, that means I need to sleep. Sleeping all the way. Yeah, sleeping. Who doesn't like a little bit of sleep? Okay, now we need some spruce wood. Da 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 Da, 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 da. I'll be so upset when my minion stone breaks, but then we'll be able to craft another one. So it's pretty cool. So let's see how many shot of minion we have now. Ah, seven. Just about enough. Oh, almost enough. Minium stone is so cool. Enchantment table, ender pearl, and so one, two, three, four, five. That, that chunk loader. No, nope, it's down here. Look at that, we're already at a full Billcraft tank.
Cool. Perfect. Now, if we go back, I want to eventually drive some cooler ways to get up here. Trust me. We have a little bit of a problem here. So I haven't turned this on. Meaning all the cans have been going, and but this is out of power. Well, it should gain power. Let's go through the system. And when it comes back through, it's going to go back round. Do our thing. And in there, back. So, our power plant is officially complete. We just need to make sure this area doesn't blow up because I'll be very angry. It takes quite a while to make this setup. It does. Now we can use uh, lava and geothermal generators to charge our bat box. So now, finally, we can go do some stuff. I put all this stuff away. I hate having pipes on me. Cool. So we want to get our bat box, some waterproof pipes, drill, and we want to get some generators. So we want to make geo thermal generators, which are empty cells, a glass, and a generator, and some refined iron and tin. So tin for tin, where's the tin? For tin cells. I think we can make this. No, it's not that we need. Refined iron, that's it. Refined iron. We got a little refined iron. Got a little bit. Need some more iron. Put all that in there. And so that in there. And turn these on. Cool. We'll have enough to make one now. Geothermal generator. Now this is finally getting really cool. I might move this chunk loader. I say I might, I say I will. Let's move it there. Do that still. Um, yeah, so what we want, wow, it's already at power, we'll see the magmatic, magmatic engines are annoyed, well, they're annoying because you got to go whack them with a wrench because it doesn't use a lot of power, you got to go whack these things with wrenches. Need a wrench. Wrench. Cool beans. In here. And we've got to whack this with a wrench. Oh, wait, no. We don't have to whack this with a wrench. Where's all our. We 
we where's all our tin cans? Tin cans, where are you? Tin cans. Oh wait, no, they're only in here. We are completely full up. That is pretty damn awesome. We need uh, a redstone engine. Need a redstone engine and a wooden waterproof pipe. Might need a little bit of cabling as well. So two piston piston two wood glass stone engine. I think I've got a lever. Lever. Uh, yep, that's all we need. Cool. So what we're going to do is we're going to have... Lever here. Getting this redstone engine ready. Have a waterproof pipe here. And then wrench that. Cool, I'm gonna then pipe that to a geothermal generator. It should accept that does it have to be top ah there we go lava lava can do actually is remove that just do it like that that would be better What we can do is then that power that gets emitted get put into that. No, it's still not getting power. <coughs> I don't know. I'll get this working eventually. Okay. Is it to do with the direction of? Come on. Is it to do with the direction of this? Yes, 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 we're getting power. <gasps> yes. Good days, good days. We're actually getting power. Oh my God, we can charge our diamond drill and get rid of the pick. <coughs> and our <coughs> shovel. So goodbye you and goodbye you. Hello you. We won't need a shovel anymore. We'll need an axe still. And if we charge that, ho oh, ho yeah, look at that. Diamond drill, here we go. 
awesome. So now we've got lava coming through. Here, there, and everywhere. So we should see cans going pump through. <coughs> cans coming <coughs> in as well. One minute. Before I wrap up this episode, I need to check the other side. Cool. I'm guessing this engine has blown and it's not getting any energy. What we can do later on is get a turtle to do that. Turtle. We should be moving on from this power pretty soon. And there's better things in the back box as well, like MFEs and things. But we won't get into that this episode. So I'll clear out the rest of this uh, by next episode. So I hope you enjoyed everyone and I'll see you all next episode. Goodbye everyone.